I've updated you guys on the coffee stand. If you guys have watched my previous videos, um, it's me showing you guys me purchasing my coffee stand and redoing the whole interior. And I believe the last time I left off, it was opening day, which honestly, you guys, was like a month and a half ago. So I have to update you guys on a lot of stuff. My sister and I, Jamie, are headed into the stand right now. I'm not working today and she isn't either. I hired all my employees that I needed to. So we're gonna go there. I have to drop some stuff off, which I do almost every single day. And I'm just gonna show you guys the inside and the outside because we've changed a lot on the stand. A few moments later. So what's going on, Bobby? What are you doing? Why are you so close? <laughs> I am at a different coffee stand right now because minimum wage, this is like stuff that I have to think about now, minimum wage just went up in Washington State to I think like $15.50, which is incredibly high. So I'm kind of stocking other coffee stands to see what the prices are at. So I might have to raise my prices. So I think the outside of the stand probably looks the same as it did before. The only thing that's different about the outside of the stand is we added little lights to it. Um, and we also have new opening signs coming in the mail, which will be super cute. And then we also are gonna paint the stand in the springtime black and gray. So it's not gonna be like the red combo with the black. It'll be something way better. Orange. Yeah, it look, literally it's supposed to be red, but it looks orange. Somebody called it brown one time. So yeah, that's pretty irritating because it's so ugly on the outside. <laughs> Let's go inside, guys. I think it probably looks kind of similar to what it did before, but there's a few changes. Come on in. So it probably looks the same since you guys have been in here last, but we got like a new curtain. We hung some yes. stuff up over All here. Right, guys, well, you have a great day. Follow me. See you later. Hi. Um, I don't know if the shelf was in this last time I was we brought you guys here, but we got a shelf over here. We got our lotus over here, but everything pretty much looks the same. I am dropping off some temporary menus, and it's kind of cool because it's all like car themed and stuff. This is a temporary menu. What do you think, Jim? Very cool. Thanks. <laughs> we got really busy for a second, so I came back to the car. I ended up helping for a little bit and then I was just in the way because there's like four people in the stand right now because it's like shift changing. Jamie's in there still helping a little bit and grabbing a drink for my mom. But you guys, I cannot explain how happy I get when I see people in line and getting coffee and just know that there's so much more to come with this stand. Like we're gonna paint the outside of the building, like I said, we're gonna get custom cups and um, merchandise, like sweaters and t-shirts and stuff like that. Oh, there's Jamie. There's so much more coming to the stand and I'm so excited and I plan to keep you guys as updated as I can with what's happening. But we're gonna meet my mom, we're gonna go shopping. <laughs> Bye! We're gonna go shopping today and yeah, it's gonna be a fun day. So, what'd you get? What'd you make? Um, <laughs> mine's white chocolate caramel. Okay. Mom's is sugar-free white chocolate, sugar-free hazelnut and salted caramel, Americano no cream triple good job I like how all the girls working right now I'm in the type R Shania Josh Bader's wife is in her series gray looks a lot like Gary and then here I might as well just show y'all but behind that truck there's a red WRX oh and this is honey that one of our customers um, got for us from his bee farm <laughs> <laughs> no that's actually really cool he showed me that they're like the big bubble, they don't do that in stores. Like it just goes straight to the top and this is what, how you can tell it's good honey. Ooh, it's a good bubble. Mm -hmm. All right, I had to show you guys the other car. But yeah, here's the red WRX I was talking about. We've had a very long day today and I didn't pick up my vlog because we kind of just went shopping. But I'm gonna pick this up tomorrow and I'll take you guys on the rest of my day. Hi you guys, it is the next day and I'm opening up the coffee stand this morning. So we're in the coffee stand already and we have a long couple days ahead of us. So I decided I would just take you guys with me on the day in the life. As a business owner and 
um, social media gal. I don't know <laughs> how I would say that, but anyways, it's like five in the morning and we just got here and this is kind of what it looks like when I get in here. It's just, I don't know. I like working mornings because it's so, it's just peaceful. It's just a great shift to work. So I just opened everything up. We got the signs. I got new open signs too, which are super cute on both sides. They match that. Um, I just got done making my Lotus. I put a splash of heavy cream in there. Mm, so good. I don't even know if I showed you guys these custom stickers, but I got these custom stickers done and it says life's better boosted. And then I don't know also if you guys have noticed this, but I have been on a light blue kick, so I have light blue straws, light blue signs, um, there's light blue in the logo right there. It matches my car carry, so I'm gonna finish opening up. I'm gonna wait for Jamie, my sister, also my employee, to come in here in a little bit, and we'll get started with the day. It's gonna be a busy one. Super exciting to see this stand pick up. It's crazy after the holidays to see like this place gradually pick up and transform, I guess. It's insane, and I'm so grateful for you guys because I meet, I meet so many of you guys through here too. And if you're not local, like even just sending me messages and comments, and it means the world to me because this was, a, it was kind of, a, it's a scary thing to do, you know, to open up your own business. But anyways, you guys, I am going to finish opening up and I'll check in with you guys later. So Devin and I are leaving out of the state of Washington. We're going to California and I'll share that with you guys like why we're going in a little bit, but I need to finish packing. I'm packing for Devin, by the way, not me. I packed last night. I got all my stuff done, but he wanted me packed for him this morning, but I'm trying to pack and we have this little bean of a cat in our bag, Bean. but I'll pick up this vlog here in a little bit when we get to the airport. And I'll kind of explain what we're doing. We are quickly in San Jose, California right now. Uh, my boyfriend Devin just bought a new car. Everyone knows me, come on now. And I might not know you. He just bought a new car and it is beautiful. It's nothing that will truly surprise you guys and I'm planning on also stealing it a little bit too. It's not my car, it's Devin's, but I ordered a mimosa. I know this isn't a vacation, but I figured why not? And then we're just gonna figure out what route we wanna take back <laughs> to Washington because we have a few different options. I'm trying to find a warm path, but nowhere, nowhere is warm. We thought it was gonna be warm in California, but it's flooding everywhere. So yeah, we're just trying to figure out life right now. But cheers to that, baby. Can you guys kind of guess maybe what I'm sitting in? <laughs> so I am super excited about this car, not only because it's an STI, because I own an STI, but because this STI that I'm sitting in is a very, very rare color. The interior on this car is amazing. So this is a 2018 Hyper Blue STI. That's the color of it. You guys can see it. The interior is amazing. It's in such good condition. I love the seats, the, the stitching in here, the steering wheel stitching, like everything about this car is so pretty, you guys. So let me show you the outside. Looks so good. I'm so excited for this car. Look at this weather though. What is this? It's California and it's raining. Oh, I hope we make it back safely. This car um, has low compression and it's not running the healthiest right now, but it's still drivable. So I'm, I'm confident that we're gonna make it back okay. I think we might try to travel for a few hours tonight and then find somewhere to stay. I just went by the gas station, I'm waiting on Devin. I got myself a huge thing of water. And whenever I travel, I always, these aren't the best on the macros, but they are so good. I get the, the peanut butter kind. I haven't even vlogged cars in so damn long. It feels so weird talking about a car right now, but yeah, this is gonna be Devin's new car. I'm 
a hundred percent gonna take steal it I'm definitely gonna steal it I'm definitely gonna drive it around since as you guys know my STI and my Evo are both sitting in the shop because I don't like to destroy them in the winter time because where I'm from it gets below zero and it snows and it's nasty and it destroys cars so both my cars are sitting in the shop a few people say like what's wrong with them you know like are they broken down what's going on I'm like no I literally just want them sitting safely in the shop I think the last video I uploaded I told you guys I was gonna be driving the blue WRX for the winter and that's not what, what happened we got that car home and I ended up driving the white type R for a really long time and then as of right now I am driving Devin's black STI so I've just been taking turn driving Devin's cars uh, the culprit himself he's got some oil for the typical Subaru but we're gonna put some oil in this car and kind of get on the road see where we decide to go we like adventure so I'm excited to see what and where we decide to go We're tasting a new energy drink. Doesn't doesn't seltzer mean it's got alcohol in it? <laughs> no. Who put these blue ass lights in there? It tastes like alcohol, but energy style alcohol. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Can I try it? You'll like it. I don't really like I don't like seltzers if there's not any alcohol. Well, You'll like it. <sighs> Told you. Uh, Told you you like it. No, <laughs> it's really not the best, but it's zero calories, so. It's no. all natural. There's no alcohol. I don't really like it. Bobby, it's supposed to be an energy drink, not an alcohol drink. I know, but. Ew, this thing sucks. <laughs> like, it's not good. We made it to Mount Shasta last night and we just stayed uh, in this hotel. And I'm a little bit nervous on this, the startup on this car because she was running a little bit and not so well last night. Oh, fire's right up. Oh my god, this... traveling for a few hours now and Devin decided to take a little um, scenic route to Crater Lake so this is we're like in the middle of the woods I want to show you guys how pretty it is up here show them. yes we made it home about an hour ago and I just wanted to end out this vlog here I'm excited to drive the Hyper Blue STI. It does have, it's only running off of two cylinders right now. I didn't say that in the beginning. So it's, it's drivable and it's running okay, but we definitely need to get that car fixed before I daily drive it. I'm excited for that though. And what I'm more excited for though is the day that I can get my cars out of storage because y'all know that I miss Gary and I also miss Barry. I miss them both. I'm going to end out this video now. Thank you guys for following me along and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.